Hey, how are you guys doing? So, we got a few announcements to go over, but first let's start with this. As of today, Love Lives is 10 years since the debut of the project. But it's been quite some time and a lot has happened. But, you know, 11 years and it's been going strong. So, can't wait to see what more is coming. I saw this on Twitter. This guy just said he was the concept artist for the upcoming Layla anime. So, if you were curious to see it, I'll give you a link in the description. I also saw this on Twitter. That the Love Life Squad Festival After School Activity New Stage, which is the arcade game only in Japan, they're going to shut down the service later this year. So, I guess that means they're not going to get any more updates for that. I don't know how this affects the PlayStation game since that was kind of the basis for that, but my guess is that's not going to get updates anyways. But I figured I might as well let you guys know as that game was shutting down. As for some new news, we have an MV here that's going to happen for one of these five songs. I'll give you a link in the description for the poll. Where you can pick one of these five songs that will get an MV, just one of them. So, I personally think I picked Jump Up High mainly because, well, Landing actually has already an All Stars, and we already had a dance MV for GMI Dash, so I kind of went with my favorite that was left. Next up, we have this sixth Love Live for that, the live for Aqua. That was, you know, multiple times they had lives canceled. So, again, we have a new try date. So we have on February 12th and 13th for next year as well as 3 5th, which is March 5th and March 6th for those days at, and having two different locations in Japan. Also we are going to get some kind of collaboration PV here and this collaboration PV is with an artist. I don't know which artist it is. I don't know. It could be like Miku or something. I don't know. But they're saying they're going to have a collaboration here. I'm very curious on what this could possibly be. Who knows, this might be with some other IO group probably. But let me know what you guys think about this and who do you think they're going to do this with. Uh, past that, we have this Aqua's Chronicle. You know, there's been a few of these over the years. They're going to do another one where this is going to have a bunch of the songs from the anime and such. This is going all the way to the movie and there's going to be a bunch of stuff like Blu-rays and photos and etc. They're also talking about in this Aqua's Club 2021 that they're going to have 100 challenges. So I think you get to submit a bunch of challenges and they'll pick 100 and they'll try to complete them. And I guess you might be able to see they're trying to do the challenges in some kind of Blu-ray that's bundled in with that going to be that big set of stuff. We also have Aqua, they're going to have a bunch of short movies or videos or something we uploaded to the YouTube channel for Love Life about Aqua so I guess that is something you could look forward to to start seeing some more of that kind of content on there I don't know exactly what this entails yet but we'll see what happens with those and we also if you're familiar with this it's the Sunshine and the Mirror this is a comics they're going to comic guys or whatever they call it so they're gonna start making these comics and you can get those for this which is that art style and you might see them before we have the Thanksgiving Festival for Squall Festival and Squall Festival All Stars, and they're going to basically have another one, and uh, that's generally where you might get a lot of news. So stay tuned for that because we might get to see a lot of news coming for both of the games there. So stay tuned for that. And then we also had part of the live stream. We had Anya or Anna Suzuki, who is the seiyu for Mari, and she was showing off the album cover. For the upcoming Guilty Kiss album, as you can see here. So at least that's the image. We don't know what songs are in it yet, but we'll have three new songs and two remixes and a bunch of all their songs. So look forward to that pretty soon. And we'll have to compare if Sharon or Azalea did a better job. Last but not least, we have Dreaming Color. You guys have probably already seen that at P or PV, whatever you want to call it on their YouTube channel, which I think has like over 4 million views now. It's been exploding, but that has been released in the full, so you can buy that. And the, probably the big thing, because that uh, video already had the full song, that this has solo versions available. So you can get solo versions of any girl for Dreaming Color if you are interested in that. You can go ahead and try and buy that, as well as some other Blu-ray stuff that are in there. But yeah, so that song is out now, so you can go ahead and enjoy that so let me know what you guys think about all of this in the comments below we have more mvpv stuff coming so i'm curious to see what do you think it's going to happen what was your favorite out of those five choices 
or the MV that they're going to make and what do you think is going to happen with the artist collaboration? Like, I guess this, you know, this is kind of a uncharted territory for Love Life because they really haven't collaborated a lot with other artists. Like, I've, I've seen sometimes they would go into the performance, you know, some kind of lives that are, aren't specific to Love Life. They have kind of danced and sang with each other. I think it was um, 2015, I remember, I think, seeing Muse doing that in some kind of live. So this is definitely going to be very, very interesting. So this is going to be the first collaboration song with another music artist, and y yes, it will be animated. So I'm very curious to see who you guys think, or at least want, to be singing with them. It, it could just be with Muse or something, I don't know. I don't think that was saying that it wasn't going to be a possibility. All I know is says that Akawa was supposed to be doing this with another artist. Since that was very vague, it could be something like that. It could just be Love Live with Love Live or maybe they're branching out. But let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. I hope to catch you guys in another video soon.